dropped in a vat of acid, set on fire, especially gold. <laughs> I couldn't stand those things when I see them back in the day. They didn't look so stupid. <laughs> and I know I'm going to trigger a bunch of people with this video. But What's up, Mother Foxers, and welcome back to the channel. Guys, today we're going to do a different video. Not going to be doing any work on the car. Look, the master cylinder's on. Hey, <laughs> that's about it. <laughs> um, do a little bit different video. I tell you, man, in my, uh, my live streams, it seems it comes up every time. The big hot topic is Fox Body Rims. That's right, <laughs> the stock rims on a Fox body. Now, there's a guy on there that absolutely hates every single last one of them. Um, but I don't think that's true. I really don't think that's true. Anyway, let's talk about it. There's good ones, to me, anyway. This is all my opinion now. Don't, don't, don't take this and just hose me out in the comments. <laughs> but honestly, the best, I think, Fox body uh, stock rim are the ponies. And there's people, especially that person I mentioned, hates them. Um, I love them, man. They were cool. I mean, back in the day when I first started getting into Fox bodies and stuff, I mean, this is when I was young, man. Um, I, everybody wanted a GT. Everybody was all about the GT, you know. Not me. And the main reason why was because of probably the worst Fox body rim there is. Just turned the whole car off on me. And that is the turbines. Those things are terrible. Those are the worst Fox body rims, dude. Them things should be dropped in a vat of acid, set on fire, and just thrown off the edge of the universe because they are terrible, terrible rims. I'm sorry, man. And I'm not sorry. I'm not going to apologize for that. They're just, they're, they're garbage. They're ugly. And that, to me, just turned the whole car off to me. I was more into uh, coupes back in the day. I loved a 5.0 coupe with ponies on them. Man, that look to me was so cool. But that is probably my favorite Fox body rim. Now, there's other ones like, uh, you know, 93 Cobra rims. Those ones are cool. Those ones are real cool. And for a while... I always wanted a set of chrome uh, Cobra R rims. And as the years went on, I seen them everywhere and they've kind of lost their luster to me as far as wanting them on my car. I still like them, they're still cool rims, but I probably wouldn't put them on my car even though they look pretty cool. Um, and I was never a big 10 hole fan until I got Black Cherry Bomb. And I still didn't like them, and then when I finally got the fenders painted and the car painted and I sat the fenders on the car and kind of stepped, stood back and took a picture of it and looked at it, and I was like, man, you know what, those aren't too bad. And it gave me an idea of how those rims could look good. And I've never shared this, and I've never seen anybody do this to those rims, ever. So that's why I wanted to do it do it to these rims and I was going to until I end up getting old Ginger Lee here and I just decided against it because it was going to be about five to between five hundred and a thousand dollar venture to do and I think um ten holes would look good as a black chrome rim I really do think that especially on that color of a car I got out there that's what I was gonna do, man. That was the big secret I kept. Uh, somebody can take this and steal it and do it if you want to, but I've never seen that done and I thought it'd be cool. I've seen a black, you know, like the SSPs, but I am not a two-tone guy. I don't like 
chrome and black on rims. You could take the coolest rim and one of the coolest rims I think that are out there that might be on this car, black sunshine eventually, are bullets, man. I love bullet rims. But when they put the chrome on the outside and the black in the center, there might as well be turbines. I hate that. Make them one color. Either chrome the damn thing or make it all black, you know. That's how I like it, you know. It's just, there's no gray area for me. It's just one or the other. Now, what are some other good rims? I'd say the TRX are cool. Um, they're not the greatest. But I think those rims would actually be pretty neat if they were like, you know, like a 10, you know. I think those would be pretty cool. But the fact that they're they're skinny and on the old Mustangs, they don't have a good look to them as far as I'm concerned. Then you got to go to the aftermarket rims. And guys, I'm not a big aftermarket rim guy. I'm really not. It's like my F-150. Any rim that's aftermarket for any truck, I think look like shit. <laughs> They don't look good, man. If people put these big old rims, like, yeah, look at my rim. They look, they look crazy. They look like crap, dude. <laughs> but it's all in anybody's opinion, you know. Somebody might like it. It's like, it's like, like I said, with the GT40 tubular intakes. Okay, I can't stand them things. I don't, I just don't like them. But there's people, there are people out there who love those, and they just think they're the best looking intake, and they think I'm crazy because I don't like them, you know. If that's what you want to put it on your car, that's fine. I'm never going to make fun of you. But if you ask me my opinion, I'm going to tell you, you know. Um, I think, you know, as far as an intake goes, 93 Cobra intake's the best. But I even think the, the Explorer GT40 is better than the tube. <laughs> but no trick flow. Their intakes look good and they work fine. But that logo, I'm not putting it on there. That logo's hideous. Anyway, back to the rims. It's like I said, no aftermarket rims are really good. Like my truck, I bought a set of FX4 rims that were in the 2012-13 era. Those are the best looking rims I've ever seen. And they're factory rims. That's why I bought them. That's why I put them on my truck. Aftermarket rims, man, they're just not good. Like everybody back in the day liked the weld rims. I like those. Or even the hideous ones, the center lines. <laughs> I couldn't stand those things when I see them back in the day. They just look so stupid. <laughs> and I know I'm going to trigger a bunch of people with this video, man. They're going to go, what are you talking about? But uh, uh, after, as far as other rims, like uh, there are the Cobra R rims that were, I call them like the three spoke, you know, those ones. Those ones are cool. And then they ended up going on an SN95s. And then they kind of redid the pony rim and made it more round and put them on, you know, five star on the SN95. But other rims that are cool are the five star uh, uh, Celine wheels, those are cool. And even the SN95 or the New Edge Celine wheels, like I think the, the, uh, the Fox Chamber has them. Those are cool, those are cool. Um, but as far as there's a rim here, and I'm gonna get shit for this, I'm sure. <laughs> Because there's a big YouTuber out there, a little big YouTuber in the Fox genre anyway that's got them and, and somebody else. But, dude, I can't do the mesh wheels. I can't do those Celine mesh wheels. Ugh, those things. You can, you can loop them in the category of <laughs> the turbines, man. I, oh, my God, I can't do those rims. They don't... And like I said, it's like the tubular intake. Some people think they're gorgeous. Some people just think they're hideous. I'm the hideous. I'm the one who thinks they're hideous. They're just not, not a good look, especially gold. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, it's, it's all subjective, man. You know, people like certain things, other people don't. But that's my, this is totally my opinion. So, hey. You tell me what's your favorite what's your favorite Fox Body stock rims or or your aftermarket ones. I mean, let me know because I mean, as as much as I say I don't like any aftermarket rims, sometimes there are cool ones. For the most part, I'm going to stick with stock. And the other, of course, I didn't mention this. The other kind of rim I do like, I do like the 10th anniversary Cobra rims. And uh, uh, as you know, if you watch the channel enough, Ginger's got a set of those on there, and those look great on her, you know. And they're going to stay on there. They're not going anywhere. I like them. And uh, yeah, man, those are pretty cool rims. Uh, but there's my opinion. My opinion. So don't beat me up too hard. I know some people are going to have some strong opinions about 
<laughs> but yeah, let me know in the comments, man. What's your favorite stock room? What's your favorite aftermarket room? I, I, let's get up a conversation. Let's start it, you know. Uh, see see how people think about that. But anyway, there, guys, there's there you go. It was just a big topic that just came up on my live stream. It seems like it comes up every time. And I thought I'd bring it to everybody else, man. Maybe you guys get a kick out of it. But anyways, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Later.